Hey guys, welcome to Zeus Fitness. Today we're coming from the Shred Shed. This is where I've been doing all my workouts during lockdown, my garage at home. So what we're gonna to do today, guys, we're gonna do a, a hit session entirely for the abs, okay? We're gonna be doing three exercises for 20 seconds each with a 10 second rest in between so you have time to adjust to get ready for the next exercise. We're gonna do four laps of that and then we change up the exercise, okay? It's not gonna take long for those abs to get burning. So it's gonna take probably 15 minutes in total to get this done and it's probably gonna last you for about three to four days afterwards the ab pain. As I say, we're gonna do 20 seconds of each. We're gonna do them in a lap like that and we're gonna do that four times in total. Let me change up the exercises. So, starting with the crunches in 10 seconds. Get ready to go. Hands on thighs, and three, two, one, and let's go. Slow and controlled, just make sure it's your abs that's doing your work, and not the neck that's jolting you forward. So always keep a bit of distance between the chin and the chest as you're doing these. Good stuff, now we're going into our leg lifts next. So hands by the side or underneath the butt if your lower back struggles with these. And away we go, just raise them up. Keeping the legs straight at all times, don't let them rest on the floor. Bring them an inch or two above the floor and then come back up. Breathe in on the way down and breathe out as you come into the ab contraction. Good stuff. Now we're going to do our bicycle crunches next. So hands on the side of the head, like so. Right angles with the legs, right elbow to the left knee, extend the right leg. Away we go. And we breathe out as we crunch up. And the head comes back after each one. It's not like the uh, Pilates crisscross that we do when we keep the head up. And stop, good job. Now we're going back to our crunches again. Hands on the thighs, breathing out as we crunch up over the knees. And away we go. And again, just imagine we got a, a rope attached to your belly button and somebody's pulling us up by that. The rope's not tied around your head, pulling you up by the neck. And stop, now going into those leg lifts. Just try and keep the back nice and flat on the ground. And away we go. Again, breathing is very important. Breathe out as you bring the legs up, breathe in as you extend them back down. And stop, good job. Now back in the bicycle crunches. So hands on the side of the head, right angles between hamstring and calves, quads and abs. And away we go. Stop. Now we should be starting to feel a little burn going on in the abs by now. Two more laps to go, starting with the crunches again. And away we go. Again, keep that chin away from the chest. Make sure it's the abs that's pulling you up and not the neck. Stop, good job, we're back to the leg lifts. And let's go. Up. Good job, and we got bicycle crunches. In position, and let's go. Breathing out as you crunch up, breathing in the way back to it. Ah, 
Darn, stop, good job. We got one more lap of eights. Definitely starting to feel those kicking in now. And let's go. Up, and we got our leg lifts next. Let's go. And stop, and finally bicycle crunches. In position, and let's go. And stop, good job. Okay, so before we go on to the next exercises, let's just have a stretch, stretch out the arms above the head and the feet underneath you. And up we go. Okay, so next three exercises we're gonna do, well, I call them angel jackknives, okay? They're kind of like a snow angel mix them with a jackknife and what they look like is this we touch our ankles feet off the ground widen our arms out like a snow angel as we kick our legs forward like so in a jackknife motion excuse me and we're going to do 20 seconds of those after that we're going to lean back we're going to clasp our hands together and we're going to twist around slowly and controlled so it's not the arms that are moving around you're twisting your torso around, so we're engaging the obliques, lower back and abs as we did. After that then, we're going to finish up with some flutter kicks. You can tuck your hands underneath the butt for this one, and we keep the legs straight on small movements, just like so. Okay, so that's our three exercises. we got 20 seconds of each to go in a circuit, and we do four laps of those in total. Alright, so starting in 10 seconds with the angel jackknives. Abs should be well fried at this stage already, so this will just be the icing on the cake. So in position, and away we go. Breathe out as you bring the knees in towards the chest. Breathing in as you extend the legs and the arms out. And stop. Good job. Okay, sorry, we're into the rotary twist next. I forgot what I was doing. And let's go. So, down nice and deep. Just make sure you're twisting your torso and you're not just moving your arms from side to side. And stop. Now we got our flutter kicks. So we're going to pop the hands underneath the butt for this one. Keep the legs straight. And remember, we're not going too high with the, with the kicks. Okay? Just small ones. Keeping the legs straight at all times. If you bend your knee, you have a tendency to arch your lower back and take the strain there instead of the abs, which is not the objective. And stop, just another three of those to go. Start with the angel jackknives again. I'm sure there's another name for these, and that's just my call. And let's go. Twist. 
two, one, let's go. And stop, now we're back to flutters. Hands underneath butt, legs out straight, and small flutter kicks. So away we go. And stop, up, come. Back to Angel Jack now, it's two down. Two more to go. Three, two, one, let's go. Stop, back to rotary twist. Now it's starting to get really tough. And three, two, one, and away we go. And step, and we're in the flutter kicks next. Three, two, one, let's go. Stop. Good job. Okay, one more set of eights to go. We got this. All right, so the angel jackknives in three, two, one. Let's go. Stop, sorry, the breathing went out the window there, guys. I'm out of breath. Okay, uh, we're right there. Into the uh, rotary twists in three, two, one, let's go. Stop, and flutter kicks to finish. And in position, and let's go. and stop Woo. so hope you all enjoyed that guys remember leave your comments below if you like what you saw we got 240 something videos down the side here to choose from plenty more where that came from and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss this fitness workout again also guys don't forget we got a six week shred program going now yeah, contact us for more details about that. We're getting great reviews about it, getting great results. So if you guys want to take part in that, get a bit of structure to your six weeks program, then give us a shout. Okay, stay safe, train like a gods, and I'll see you soon.